what is going on everybody welcome back it is friday january 7th we're closing out the first trading week of 2022 let's talk about small cap land and day trading opportunities for us that were out here let's start things off with ford ford was hot this last week going on a beautiful run from 21 up to a high of 25 today it opened at the top part of its range nice sell off down to 24 getting a nice little down bounce to the upside a lot of good consistent volume with ford another stock i heard a lot about on twitter was dogz it had a real big sell-off here and crash from nine to three dollars i've seen a lot of people was able to catch the dead cat bounce on dogz look at the insane volume flowing into this right here today so a nice move from 250 up to 450 good two dollar pop on that a lot of real fast opportunity today real fast we also had disca disck and viac if you guys remember these stocks from back in the day when they had a big downfall these been getting nice rebounds recently today discovery running from 2750 up to a high of 31 let's take a look at jwel we were watching this this morning after its recent big downfall here from 26 getting drilled for four straight days all the way down to a low of 450 just about today nice fast rebound on it from 450s running all the way up to six dollars a share we also had lcid go on a nice rip this morning right out of the open from 37.50 up to 40 bucks then pushing up to 41 lcid is just such a beast it got drilled down for three days just about nice rebound back up to its highs on lcid a lot of consistently good volume on LCID. We have a new IPO today, H O U R, running from $4.50 up to a high of $9 a share. This is what it's all about right here, you guys. Patiently waiting and waiting and waiting. Something will come along. As long as I have been around you guys, the market has always given me one or more opportunities. You just have to patiently wait for them. And that can be the hardest thing sometimes because you can get caught up in the excitement, the pre-market, when that bell rings, getting caught up, your adrenaline's rushing. You don't know what's going to pop off and be the hot stock. So you're freaking out and searching all around. Real quickly, the top stocks that were gapping up this morning turned out to be stinkers. We even called it out in the Discord chat this morning. We were was not a fan of what was gapping up this morning. M-R-I-N. Let's pull it up. As you see, popped off after hours yesterday. It was opening up at this $4 level. It had a real quick snap up to 5 Just running into bag holders from everybody who bought in after hours here. And even before that, just stalling out right at 5 bucks and just failing to continue. The other stock... That was up pre-market. ABSI once again pops off after hours yesterday when the market closed. Opening up here around this 950s level. Just getting drilled down all the way to 750s. The top stocks gapping up this morning really didn't do anything. It's been all about the stocks that have been in play for days on end. ISIG still giving out tremendous opportunity running today from 21 up to a high of almost $26 a share. Yeah, from 21 to 26. That's a five dollar move you guys in the first half hour of the trading day falling back to 2250 and running back up three dollars to 2550 there's opportunity out here like we've stated remember you focus on garbage you're gonna get garbage you want to focus on quality setups and stocks VORB, nice move, 650s, right up to eight bucks and still pushing high of day. 
So there's a lot of opportunity out here. A lot of opportunity. You guys are interested. I have a Discord server. Feel free to join it. Go into my channel. Go into the description. There should be links to my YouTube channel. Then from my YouTube channel, you can follow me in the Discord. We're all in here together, guys. We're all here for the same reason. To get that money so working together patiently waiting for these setups and having multiple eyes in the markets to spot potential opportunity that's what it's all about here at trading learning 101 hopefully you guys have a good weekend end out this friday and the week strong i know it was a rough one for a lot of people do not give up take it one day at a time and as i always say have that patience have that discipline and study 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 later you guys